the story of how the bracelet came about. I can remember it to this day. It was 2006, I think, uh, May or June. The idea was so big and it felt so powerful. I had to actually pull off the freeway and and uh, take a break. And I remember getting to the office and calling a few people. And you know, we, we've had ideas in the past, and you know, everyone goes with, you know, it's a great idea. Let's see what happens. But this one we knew was uh, special and unique. The bracelet it comes in an individual package, and we started giving them out in 2006. And there's no marketing, there's no advertising. The, the bracelet or our blog or the website has no mention of, of who we are or anything like that. So we haven't done any newspaper ads, we haven't done any you know, SEO or any type of website advertising. And we've actually sent out over 800,000 to 57 countries. The 800,000 is pretty cool, but the 57 countries is, just blows me away. We have a very lofty goal for this bracelet. And as we've always said, it's the absolute bare minimum of this world and what it's missing. It's the foundation. And getting this bracelet into more and more hands is going to put people in a better mindset. It's, it's been proven with the bracelets we've sent all over the world. When you give a bracelet to someone for a simple act as opening a door, or someone who forgot their wallet at a gas station, you pay a dollar for a drink, their face lights up like you cut them a check for a couple thousand dollars. And you, and you sit there and you, you watch this bracelet change hands and you, and you just don't understand why such a simple thing can change the view of this person. And it's, it's just a small ripple effect that goes out and that one little act can impact 100 people. Imagine the simplest of things and what it can do to impact someone's world. If we can get people in a better mindset, you are more likely in a better mindset to donate more money and for sure you're going to donate more time to other charities. If we can get millions of other people doing more time and more money to these charities, imagine what the world will be like. And you have to get out of that mindset of believing you, you, know, you don't need to be, like I said, a millionaire or a celebrity. You don't need a platform. You simply need day-to-day -day life. You simply need to pass the thousands of people you pass on the way to work, on the way to school, on the way home, whatever. Imagine that bracelet in tens of millions of hands, changing hands four or five times, 40 or 50 million people impacting each other. If you really want to change the world, this is the absolute foundation. This is as simple as it gets, and it will, it will make an impact. Pay it forward to me is the, the general way of, of giving it a name, giving it a substance, giving it something people can latch on to. And the first time I actually gave a bracelet was at a gas station. A simple little thing. The person in front of me forgot their wallet. It was like $1.75 for a drink and a donut. And I had a 20 on me and I said, oh, don't worry about it, man. Don't go to your car. Just, I have it. When I gave that guy that bracelet and I just saw that look in his eyes, a dollar seventy-five and a bracelet, I can promise you made him go home and change the view of the people around him. And I'll never hear about it. I'll never, probably never see that guy again. So it doesn't need to be one big, huge thing that's going to impact someone's life. The biggest things in the world are tiny. All I'm asking is that you take that bracelet, put it on your wrist, and then the next day, the next week, whatever it may be, be on the lookout for someone who needs help. Imagine the impact that has. It doesn't need to be big. So all I'm asking is to take that bracelet, pay it forward to someone, and tell me that is not the best, the best feeling in the world. And when that feeling doesn't go away for a couple minutes or maybe an hour, maybe that just changes how you view the world, just let me know and we'll get you more bracelets.